stay in New York City now as we Track continue Detroit. our team coverage. Let's bring in Phil Archer now. He is covering the Clinton campaign this evening. Phil. And Hillary Clinton will be speaking live inside Javits Center here tonight in just a couple of hours. But here outside, the party's already started. They have blocked off 11th Avenue and several thousands of reporters, of her supporters, I should say, are now crowding, packing into it. They're expecting a huge crowd in and around the center tonight. At the same time, we're also hearing about record lines, record turnout, and polls all across the nation. We saw some of that for ourselves here in New York City today. Jawan, hello from New York City. Where the Following Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton to the polls here, tens of thousands of their fellow New Yorkers are enduring long lines to cast ballots. At this polling place in Midtown Manhattan, the wait for voters this election year at least twice as long as before. This location it's never taking me more than about 15, 20 minutes. But today I expect to be here for about 45. Doreen DeMusis has been the poll coordinator here for the past two presidential elections. Even in busy Manhattan, she says she's never seen it like this. I anticipate three to 3,000, 3,500 before we close, just at this site. And that's different from past years, oh, past presidents. Oh, yeah, 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 absolutely. Way more. No matter who they're for, DeMusis says many voters are telling her and her staff they feel in this election, they have to vote. You know, can I show you something? Olivia Giovetti told us for her, it's about duty and family. That woman right there is my grandmother. These were their pictures when they immigrated from Syria in the 1920s. Right. Um, and she almost didn't make it out. I voted for her as much as I voted for wow, myself today. Yay. The polls close here in New York City tonight at 8 o'clock Houston time. By that time, we should have some idea of which way this race is breaking nationwide. But with those long lines at the polls, it's a pretty good bet this is going to be a long night. We're going to be here for, for you throughout bringing it to you from New York. Till then, I'm live in New York City. Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.